Just know, Charles will never honor a bond with you northerners. Unlike him, my word can be trusted. Ha! You are no more than a wounded dog at my table looking for scraps. How dare you! Wait! Eva! Finally, we can talk sense. What of Richardis? Did you encounter Charles? Richardis survived the trial by fire. The flames never touched her. And the king? Did you do as I asked? I fought Charles, but he still lives. You made no promise to kill the beast. And maybe I was fooled to ask you. But tell me you did not take the king's words over mine. Richardis had her own ideas about the future of Frankia. I grew sympathetic to them. After all I have done to try and keep her safe from him. She convinced me that her plan was sound. She meant to subdue the king. Truly, she has a spell over him. This is your plan for the long-term safety of your people? She will ready the boy Bernard to be the next king of Frankia. He is yet a piglet! You should be glad, Odo. Charles is gone. He will not bother you anymore. Maybe. But I won't stand by idly and watch this kingdom crumble any further. At least we can drink to Charles being subdued. Let us go! We have work to do! What do you think he will do? Odo will look for Charles, and if he can, he will kill him. But Odo's anger could be his undoing. I will have Pierre's eyes on him for some seasons to come. A wise step. Can Richardis really keep Charles from returning to an active kingship? That is the wager I have made. And the lives of my clan depend on it. They can depend on more than that. You still have me. I will be sure to send word should Charles slither out of whatever pit Richardis has put him in. To your relations with Odo, consider returning to him the lands that Charles pledged to Siegfried. No. Those lands are compensation for the hardship he has caused us. Odo kept Paris. That is enough. You sound more Yarl like all the time. And now I must think of my own people, whom I have been away from for too long. Before you go, have this. It was my father, Sinrix, the second best leader and teacher I have known. It has been my honor. I hope to lead as well as you do, Eivor. If ever you hunger for more Frankish cheese, I will be happy to share. <laughs> Farewell, Toga.
safe. It will be many winters before Frankish troops land on the English shore. My spies say Paris fell. It did. But the situation is thornier than that. In what way? The Queen, Rashadis, believes she can subdue the Mad King in isolation. They have withdrawn to a faraway place. But Charles has such a stormy reputation. Can this Queen tame such a man? Rashadis has a deep well of courage to draw from. And she holds sway over Charles like no other. That is comforting. We also have a hardy ally in Toka Simbenik's daughter. She is young. And a quick study. <laughs> she will do right by us. Perhaps they need not know the danger we face. We came home with bounty, glory, and some Frankish foods. I can ask the raiders to keep their tales to that. They will say everything, and then some. <laughs> Afraid so. New strength comes to weathered halls. Now I can rest. Thank you.